Yeah, so we're uh, back with this again. Uh, yes, this is the uh, second episode in two days, but uh, I really enjoyed yesterday's episode, so I thought I'd uh, bring this one out for you here. So yeah, we're we're gonna get into it. I'll quickly have a look at the uh, the vote in the video and see what people did for who they want us to sign, and then we'll uh, have a look into getting them. So look at the result of the vote from last episode, you want me to try and get um, a striker. So uh, looks like I'll be replacing Fletcher or Forestieri, ideally Forestieri, because Fletcher's, Fletcher's pretty Brexit. So uh, yeah, we'll, we'll replace Forestieri, but the real question is which, which striker are we going for? Big Ashley Barnes or Big Troy Deeney? Ooh. I'm, I'm thinking... I'm thinking Ashley Barnes first. Because I'm sure Bur Burnley might actually want Forestieri. Even though we could have Forestieri and Deeney. Oh, Hello? Sexy dice. Sexy dice. Stunning. Got some worms for you, mate, if that's uh, sweet enough for the deal. So, uh, we'll offer him Forestieri as well. Forest area. Uh, yeah, yeah, uh, what? 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 Uh, uh, eh? Um. We don't have our type of money. We can offer you five. You think we're made of money? Lot of me inside. No. That didn't uh, go to plan. Let's try and send Forest area back to a. Uh, actually. Do we offer Fletcher in this one and try and get Forestieri and Deeney playing together? No, we'll do, we'll do a swap deal. They're looking to bring in a centre back, full back, or striker. Well, we have just replaced a full back, but oh no, we did a swap deal, didn't we? Moussa Bowdery looks quite good. Um, Fletcher? Still not interested. Um, we'll offer him. Ooh, ooh. This does mean we'll have to try and get a centre back straight after. I'm going to try and lower the money because we need to try and get a centre back as well to replace this guy. So I'm going to, I'm going to say two million. The same three and a half or five percent. How about we go 2.75 without the sell on clause? 2.95 just to save the extra 100k. I'm gonna be cheeky. There we go. Troy Dean is on his way to the club. I can, I can hear it already. Barry Bannon to Dee There he is, look at him. Big Troy Deeney. Crucial, of course he's going to be crucial. Of course he is. Two year contract, yeah, yeah, I'm happy with that. No release clause. 37 grand, Ooh. oof. Um, 32 and a half. Not quite what he's open for, but he's accepted it. Troy Deeney has <laughs> signed for Sheffield Wednesday. Shit house, get in. So I think what we're going to do is we're going to... Oh. <laughs> I think we'll do it like that then. Harris can go onto the bench instead of Murphy because Harris is a better winger. And then, uh, there we go, we've got that. Look at that. The, the team's looking a lot better already. So we're going to have to replace that centre back as well. Oh, we could get a right back. But I think we're going to go with a. Go with Dawson. Dawson would probably be quite cheap. Or do we go with Shawcross? I think we'll try Shawcross first. See what I want for Shawcross. Shawcross, what, what, what are you saying? Oh, 
he's the only other centre half that we can offer him. Actually, no, we're off him. Actually, no, they don't want they don't want that uh, midfielders. He is not English. Luengo in eight grand. No, just straight swap Luengo. Luongo even Luongo, one pound. One pound fish. <laughs> Ryan Shawcross is on his way to the club now. Squad roll is going to be important, but they might ask for crucial. Important, he's happy with that. Like for the contract, he's he's we'll try a four-year contract till he's thirty-five. Two year yet, yeah. that that suits him better. To be fair, no release clause. Fifteen. Oof. No bonus, and you got a deal. Get in. Come on. Shawcross is now at the club as well. Seventy-two rated. It, it, it'll do. It'll do. I think what we'll do here though, because Kieran Gibbs got the number four shirt, didn't he? I think what we'll do here: bring Bates onto the bench instead of Palmer. Put Shawcross in there. Then what we'll do is we'll give Shawcross a number four shirt and we'll give Gibbs the number three shirt. Because three is more suited to a left back, so we'll do we'll do that now. So we'll give Gibbs the uh where is it? There it is. Number three shirt. Shawcross goes up to twelve, but Shawcross you're gonna take the number four shirt. That looks a lot better. There we go. Now we still have we still have quite a bit in the wage budget, don't we? As if we're just doing a straight swap there. So he's Hutchins Hutchinson's coming in. in the mid what let's have a look at the age of the players. What could we improve now? Where where do we look? Uh Maybe replace Hutchinson, maybe try and get one of the centre mids maybe. Lee Catamo. Just wanna put it like that just so we can see what we got. We've got two point eight million and forty grand. What they want us to do. Gain automatic promotion, Jesus. <clears throat> Top two, yeah? Top two. Um Look at our low, low work rates. We need someone who's going to put the effort in, so... Uh, they're not willing to sell, but we could just pay his release clause. Perfect. Because, no matter what, Lee Cartball's going to be starting. I don't care his rating, we're just making this team. We don't care about the ratings, we just want to make the team. Lee Cartball is going to be important. Look at him. Oh, Daniel Farker is agent. Yep, yeah, definitely. Two year contract. Perfect. Uh, no release clause, yeah, I'm happy with that because we, we just use a release clause to get you here, so yeah. I, I don't like the uh, the bonuses, just save a bit of money on the bonuses. There we go. Now Lee Catamol's in the club. Oh. Hmm. <laughs> but the uh, 69. So we're going to move uh, Hutchinson onto the bench instead of Windass because they put one of the eight eight strikers at the club you know Lee Catamo comes in look look at that look at that if you get past that if you you will never get past them two centimeters you're gonna get your leg broken either way you go on you go on the left side you're gonna get your leg broken by Catamo if you try to go on the right side you're gonna get you're gonna get your leg broke by Bannon it's it's a lose lose situation for you mate you just just stay away from him you pass the ball before you get anywhere near him. So what what can we look at getting next? Maybe Joe Hart next? I think Joe Hart next would be the uh, the option really. Just straight swap for Westwood hopefully. Welcome back Sean Dyche. Um, we wanted to get another one of your players to straight swap. Mate. We give you Westwood, you can have Hart. Fullback striker on midfielder, so they don't want. We didn't get Barnes, did we, sir? Okay. 
What will he want? Kieran Lee's a club icon, so I'm going to keep him. Luffy Hutchinson, because he might start moaning about his playing time. Fullback striker or midfielder still. Other position striker. We could just give him Forestieri. All roads. Sam Winnell. What are you saying? Four million in Sam Winnell, isn't it? Or two million do we need to pay Joe Hart's wages as well. I'm pretty sure Joe Hart's wages are about twenty grand. Yeah, that'll do. Winnell two million. <laughs> this should do it. Hopefully. Two and a half million, please. <sighs> he really wants this money, doesn't he? We'll be getting a bit of wage budget from a uh, winner anyway. Three million. Give you some time, okay. In the meantime, we'll transfer list all the players that aren't um, British. Westwood is Irish, but I'm I'm fine with that. Anyway, that's on the uh, the two islands. I'm fine with. Scotland's fine. Netherlands is not fine. So you're going on the transfer list. Once again, Netherlands is not fine. Oh, he's on loan. We'll, we'll, we'll keep him anyway. We don't want to spend money to terminate loans, do we? Chirouz, when that's for... <sighs> Forestieri. Transfer list. A new you. He's going on the transfer list as well. We, we, we want a British team. British and Irish team. Surprise, but glad I've taken steps having asked. Just exploring. It's fine, mate. They want us to make Troy Deeney captain. <laughs> I have no objection to that. Is Lee, Lee's, Lee's don't have the leadership. Shawcross does. And so does Troy Deeney, but I'd, I'd rather have Troy Deeney as my captain, to be quite honest. So I'll make Troy Deeney captain for this first friendly. So we, we, haven't, we haven't heard back about Joe Hart yet, so that'll probably be after this friendly. Strasbourg. We, we're going to sim the friendlies. We don't want to play the friendlies. We'll play, we'll play the league games and the cup games, obviously, but not friendlies. And we lose 1-0. Oh, well. It's, it's, it's friendlies, it's fine. Transfer off unacceptable for Joe Hart. I'm going to have to reject it because we could offer Forestieri. Because we have just put Forestieri on the uh, loan list. No, on the transfer list. Straight swap Aaron Lane and Forestieri, I'm thinking. Because then Aaron Lane just slots in where Forestieri was. Grand, uh, lower it to 300 and he got a deal, Daishi. 4.460, yeah, go on then. So Aaron Lennon will be coming to club to replace Forestieri. Crucial, okay. Oh, Daniel Farker's back. I'm not signing any Norwich players, it's fine. Two year contract. No release clause. Oh, this is the hard part. We don't know what his wages are. I'm just going to do that and see if it works. Fair offer. Okay. We have got Aaron Wannan now. 73 rated. It will do for the championship. It will do nicely. 
Look at that Aaron Wellen just slots straight in there. So we've got another friendly coming up against Genko. We've got a transfer for Bannon. Oh. Now I think with Bannon we'll be trying to do a swap with John Joe Shelby maybe with Bannon. So reject that and just try and do a swap with for John Joe Shelby with Bannon. I'm tempted to keep Bannon there. Been off John Joe Shelby because look at his work rates. Yeah we're not going to get John Joe. John Joe is unfortunately no longer coming to the club. We'll get, we'll get Dawson in. Because I don't think Dawson will be too much because he's 35, so. Straight swap for Lees with Dawson. I don't even think we need to swap, to be fair. Let's give, offer him 500 gram, maybe. Fair offer, there you go. Lees will be staying at the club while we sign Michael Dawson. Lees can be a good backup centre back for us. Welcome, he's going to be important, yeah, ah yes, aye. It's going to be first team. Two year contract. Yep. No release clause, I'm happy with that. Wages, there we go again. Uh, we'll do the same as Aaron Lennon here. If we can afford that, we can. Only just afford it. There we go, fair offer. So these three are the three left to get. Barnes is going to be the hardest. Then Joe Hart, then Amiobi, I reckon. So we're going, to, we're going to play Amiobi on the left, so we're going to be swapping reach for Amiobi, probably. But there you go, as you can see, we've got Lees in there at the moment, but we're going to do, going to do a swap Dawson in on the bench, and uh, Dawson in for Lees. I think Dawson's probably going to be maybe our captain, but Deanie's... Deanie's up there. I want, I want the cats to be our captain there. Look at him. <laughs> Catamol's stats are already going down. <laughs> but Bannon. Yeah, we're, we're going to be keeping Bannon anyway because Bannon's a bit of a shit house, so he'll work quite well with it. We're going to go down the English route, but I'm thinking Bannon's just, just as a shit house with himself, isn't he? So yeah. Oh yeah, I was looking at maybe getting Trippier, but we've got I offer. And Trippier might be over the budget. Right, with Reach, we're going to be swapping Reach for uh, Amiobi, hopefully. So we'll go and try and do that deal now. We haven't got much money left. So what we need to be doing here is just doing straight swaps now. Like, no money recently arrived. We can't get Amiobi. So, so we're going to have to not get Amiobi, I want to I want to be signing a, a winger but oh, I'm thinking more of the, uh, the shithouse route so we found our uh, we found our shithouse player, we're going to go with Chris Maguire I think with Chris Maguire we might, right, we don't have any money actually I was going to say we might be able to offer money, we don't have money just take reach and go, take reach and go I'm sorry, I, I, I like Reach, but... Ow. Rotation, if he's happy with rotation, we'll put him as rotation, but he'll be playing anywhere. <clears throat> Two-year contract, yep. No release clause. Eight grand, um, no bonus, and you got a deal, mate. They're happy with that. There we go, we're done. Chris Maguire is 67 rated, he's not playing for she Sheffield Wednesday. He's going to go, Windass is going to come out of the team. Chris Maguire is going to come in, I think what we'll do is we'll put Carol Lennon play on the left, Aaron Lennon can play on the left, who's better with the left foot? Chris Maguire's better with his left foot, so we'll leave Chris Maguire on the left. One on the right, Catamol and Bannon, Fletcher and Deeney. We've got our Brexit team. 
It's looking very good to be fair. I think we're going to enjoy this season. So I'll be playing the games, so that should be a very enjoyable watching Dawson trying to get back. We've got another friendly here against Gink. This is our second friendly. This is, good. This is our first team, remember? And we drew 1-1 with Gink. Dini getting the goal. Up the Dini. We've got an offer for New You and Wildsmith. Wildsmith is English, so... Ideally, we don't be selling, but New You is from Kosovo. I think we'll just accept that. So we've got a lot. Oh, international management. I know we'd be managing England, Wales, Scotland, Northern Ireland, or Republic of Ireland. These are all our uh, players that we've been scouting. Yes, I did scout Dean Marnie. I scouted World Grig as well, I was thinking about getting him. Uh, we'll negotiate this one. Say so we can get about 9,010 for him, so we'll try that. There we go, yeah. That's perfect there, so New You and Pelopesi are on their way out. So we've got Hanover 96 next in a friendly. Are we going to beat Hanover? We do, Troy Deeney getting the two of the goals. Deeney! So we, we have qualified, so I think that we've qualified from the group, so we've got, look at Dawson's energy, look at Dawson's energy. His stamina is not that good, New You is not going. The talks have broken down, okay. Look at Dawson's energy, that's not going to be fun. Probably have to keep swapping Dawson out. So we'll do his friendly against Norwich. Are we going to win? We probably won't. So one all draw. We lost on penalties. Hernandez getting an 85th minute equaliser and then it went to penalties. Pilipes is out. We've got our money. And we should... Should be able to um, get Barnes or Hart. Barnes is expensive, so is Hart. How much money have we got? I think Barnes is a pipe dream to be fair. So we're going to stick with Fletcher and uh, Deeney up front for now. Barnes is going to be our one that we're aiming for, our, our hope, our dream. Here and Westwood, come on. Full back midfielder or striker again. Um, what full backs we got? No. Midfielders. Uh, Hutchinson. No. Strikers. Forestieri went in another deal. Rhodes, no. Winnell. Knew you. Come on, he's a Burnley. He's Burnley style of play player. I don't want to be offering Kieran Lee. I love I'm on a barger. They're happy with it. Fop no. Right, we'll do two million. 
What? Piss off. I want my Joe Hart. I want my Dandruff. So we're going to have to wait till next Monday to try and get him. Bristol City want new you. I'm just going to accept it because he's from Kosovo. We don't want him at a club because he's not Brexit. Lees. This is Tom Lees, okay. Uh, 2.2 million. I don't really want to be selling Lees. If we're going to be selling, if we're going to be getting rid of Lees, I want him to be using him as a swap deal player. New Year's gone. We can try and get Joe Hart again. Right now, we know that he'll get pissed off if we uh, offer him two million. We'll try and offer someone better than Odebarger, like Lees. When he wants a fullback midfielder or striker, we could try and offer Lees for it. What winger midfielder or striker now? What wingers we got? Kadeem Harris. Kadeem Harris, two and a half million. One point seven five, and you've got a deal. Two point two. Let's meet in the middle. It's two million. 2.2. I'm I'm not gonna say anything again because I just want to get this done. Right, finally, we're on our way to getting Joe Hart. Crew, it's gonna be a crucial goalkeeper, of course. It's gonna be our first team goalkeeper. One year, no, two year. No release clause. He's willing to take a pay cut to come here. Perfect. Joe Hart is now at the club. Is he number one? He's number 12. I'm guessing Westwood's, Westwood will be number one. I don't want to change that. So we'll put him... Um, we'll move Westwood to the bench instead of Wildsmith. And we'll put um, Joe Hart in goal. The team's looking a lot better already. Apart from certain positions. But the team is looking fairly decent for a championship side. Well, Windass is eager to get onto the bench, but Murphy's a better player. And so is, so is Connor Wickham. But yeah, that team's looking very good as Joe Hart got leadership he's cautious with crossing oh. we don't need to do instructions we'll do instructions when it comes to it we'll, we'll sim the last few days up until the first game of the season I'm, I'm thinking about playing the first game of the season in this episode depends how long it takes Kieran Lee no Kieran Lee is good. he's not going anywhere all transfers blocked for Kieran Lee. Kieran Lee, I, I'd, I'd say Kieran Lee is like um, Chef we Sheffield Wednesday's Dean Marnie. So we'll go to our press conference. And Troy Deeney gets a training injury right before the first game of the season we're going to be missing Troy Deeney but I think Rhodes can go in and then we'll put um, Wickham on the bench then so no Troy Deeney for the first game of the season Short, well for a few weeks Shawcross will take over as captain yeah I'm happy with that look look at the pace look at the pace between them two they've got a combined pace of 69 It's written in the stars, isn't it?
So we're going to save that team. We're going to go do the press conference. Then we'll, I'm going to play the first game of the season. Let's do it. And there's a Patelster. You're a bit loud. I have faith in my team. I do. I do have faith in the team. It's promotion more than a, more than a dream. We'll give it everything we've got. Hart's transfer from Burnley stands out as one of the bargains of the year. What do you expect from his debut against Reading? He'll be good for the team. He will be. There we go. Thank you. Right, away, away at Reading. Away at Reading, first game of the season. What? Let's be honest, I'm, I've got to play this song, Anna. I've got to play this song. We're gonna we're gonna play world class. So I'll play. I'll probably play the song in the background again. So we're gonna wear. Uh, go into the first game of the season gets ready. Let's try and pick up all three points for the first game of the season. Let me turn the commentators off real quick. Because I don't want to commentate on this game. I'm going to turn the crowd down a bit as well because it'll be a bit loud. Right, the commentators are on. We'll turn the sound, the crowd down a bit as well. Turn the crowd down to three. There we go. That, that, that's, a, that's a good sound. That's a good figure sound. So Liam Moore leads out Reading whilst Ryan Shawcross leads out Sheffield Wednesday. Look at look at the team. Look at the team. Look at them all. And here we go. The first game of the season. Sierra and Lennon. What was that? Gibbs wins it back into Bannon. Lee Catterbolt. I'll break your legs. Oh, he's put it to Jordan Rhodes. Jordan Rhodes has got a great chance here. Jordan Rhodes. Oh. Just over the bar. Come on. Counter attack. Oh, Catamol. You've angered him. <laughs> Why is Shawcross coming out of centre back? Well, he's Shawcross it. And we're conceded. And the Rinamosa. <sighs> Shaw cross. They wanted a penalty for that. Ref's not giving it. And there's half time. Joe Hart really living up to his standards, not being able to save the ball. On better second half lads. Are they booing roads? Aaron Lennon's cross. Oh, it's cleared. Needed a better header from McGuire there. Oh, there's push gas. Rhodes. Oh, Rhodes is taken up. It's forward to Fletch. Oh, Fletch. Come on, Lee. Oh, Lee, you've lost the ball. Go on, Fletch. Fletch, go on, go on, go on, Aaron. Aaron, Aaron's still going. Aaron, with the plays in the box. Oh, yes! <laughs> Jordan Rhodes with the equaliser. <laughs> Get in. The replacement for Troy Deeney due to his injury, and he gets a goal. That's what you want from a striker. Great movement in the box to get to the ball and he fires it home. Look at the movement of him there. Great movement to the front post. Fires it into the back of Raphael's net. Great thought from John and Rose there to get to the front post. 1-1. One, one. Get in. Probably going to do some subs in a second as well. We'll do, we'll do the subs now. 
So looking at um, fitness wise, we'll bring Murphy on for Lennon. I've just bought a Wickham on. Murphy on for Lennon. Uh, I think we need someone to come in left mid. Could do this, move Gibbs up to left mid, bring Odebarjo on left back, and uh, someone on for Catamo. We'll bring Kieran Leon in for Catamo. Come on, I think we're going to get a draw out of this one. There we go, first game of the season. Finishes a 1 0 draw away to Reading. The way the game went, I'll take a draw. We, we had our chances though, but oh, I'll take a draw. Well, I, I want to watch that goal again. That goal from John and Rhodes again. Look, look, look at the movement of him at the back post there. Just comes in front, fires it home. So that's what we like from. That's what we love to see from a striker. Aaron went over great driven cross to the front post, and he's just made his movement. Got in the right position, just fired it home. Great power. Raphael's getting nowhere near that. Time for a few questions. Okay, look, look at him. Is a draw on your debut for Sheffield Wednesday good enough result to please you? The way the game went, yes. It's a marathon, not a sprint. There we go. Drought failed to make an impression. He, he didn't have much to do apart from that goal. Danger of losing his starting spot. The one up changes the one up will change every week, I think. Why there'll be a few changes with Dawson's stamina not being too good. But you know. Well you know a bit worried I've read some speculation about me why it's giving you another chance to be my best man for the job out. Well I'll change every week, I'll just set that to him. Alright, we're gonna end the when the episode off here. It's a good start to the season so far. I mean a, a draw is not the end of the world, it It's not gonna it might come back and bite us at the end of the season, but anyway, it's a good game. John Rhodes getting the uh, the goal for us, so yeah, that's perfect for us. So, thanks for watching. Hopefully, we'll shit out with the Patelson next episode. Ciao, guys. <laughs>